Hello friends, I am Abhishek from Keyframes Online. Today we will see uh, how to make a kitchen design in 3D Max. Uh, I am taking as a reference image like this will be a kitchen. And for this we have to keep in mind uh, how much inches we have to uh, ceiling, uh, how, what will be the height of our ceiling that is uh, almost you know standard, standard size are there like 10 feet and uh, generally what will be the lintel level so uh, for that let's get started i'm going to 3d max just be sure go to customize start with unit setup this is generic units we have to first understand what is generic units go to system unit setup you will see one unit 3d max one unit is is equal to millimeters that is 1 mm so i want inches that is if i increase 1 in 3d max it will be 1 inches if you want 1 feet if you increase 1 it will be on 1 feet so i want inches i'll say okay i'll say okay again i'll go to file and say reset now whatever i'll take a box and this is 1 1 and one so this square is the cube is one inches one inches by one inches so this is how we work on generic units this will be a one and inches so I'll go reset the scene now I'll just take a plane that is say 140 and by 120 <coughs> you don't have to increase like this you just say 140 and 120 that is 10 feet 120 I'll take spline I'll take line I'll snap it say 2.5 this like this escape I'll go to modify I'll go to spline I'll select the spline just turn off snap I'll go to outline either you can click and drag like this and say like this we want 6 inches 6 inches that is a uh, width of a wall you can type like this 6 I'll go to extrude I'll say 120 that is 10 feet now I'll just set up a camera Control C. Now here we will design some kind of this you can say. This is the front. I'll take this box twenty eight inches. I'll say 65 32 go to snap snap object like this 
I'll press F4 on my keyboard. I'll off. I'll press S and of the snapping tool. Now I just add a segment from here. I just want like this. How much dividition is there? The upper part will be will be added later on. I'll go to modify. I'll say edit poly. I'll select edge. I'll click on edge. I'll press control on my keyboard. I'll say loop. That selects the whole loop. I'll say chamfer. It will give a proper two segments. I want this kind of I'll say okay. Now I'll go to edges. I'll select the edge. This one and this one. I'll say ring. The ring selects the whole thing. And I'll press control on my keyboard. I'll click on polygon. It's give me the selection. I'll go to extrude. I want to extrude in minus, but it's going a weird way. I'll click on local normal. That's something like this. This goes inside. I want one groove on there. Minus two. Now I'll duplicate this box like this. I'll shift inside. I'll again make copy of this. Shift rotate, but it's not rotating properly so for this we will add we will click on angle snap tool and on percentage snap tool shift drag it will give proper 90 degree I'll tilt the camera. I'll select the camera because uh, first I always uh, select the camera. Yes, uh, so I'll go to file, I'll import on freeze, merge, models I can take which, ah, oh, cast tools there. 
let's see all else okay group But later on, we want to do one thing also. I'll go to top. I'll text line. top kitchen top okay. this is here shift this thing Friday, March, Sync, Group, just scale it down. We want to fit like this. So, this is what we have to make one hole. Uh, that's why we have taken a separate kitchen top. I'll make Go to modify and say I don't want extrude right now. I'm off uh, this thing, start new shape off, take rectangle. Now rectangle is here. to match perfectly like this go to select vertices I'll say fillet and if you say extrude you will get a hole here perfectly this is what we want and this is done in camera we won't be seeing the issue will be sort out if your view is like this we can make like this so it's not a problem So now I'll arrange a fridge for you. But later on, we can see uh, first we'll 
keep in mind we have to make a ceiling also uh, so we have to make here one storage unit so in next part uh, we'll doing the storage unit